Hi, I'm Monica Bay. We're at the University of Florida at a spectacularly good program on e-discovery, e-discovery project. And I'm with Jacques Nock. Did I, Nock, did yeah. I get it right? <laughs> yes, Jacques Nock. Oh, thank yes. you so much. Yeah. And you've got a very interesting consultancy. Why don't you tell us a little bit about that? And I'd like to find out how, what your advice is for students who may be interested in going into e-discovery. Yes, um, I work with data. Um, I've always loved data. I think that it might come naturally to an attorney to maybe dream about pleadings and, and writing uh, and doing the best hearing. Uh, for me, it's always been data. I can think about it and I can see just about every facet of life. So my consultancy uh, right now advises uh, law firms and large corporations on issues around text mining, text analytics. Uh, some issues of the discovery, but always as it relates to mining and understanding that data and presenting it so that it can support their, uh, uh, their case strategy, etc. And what is the name of your consultancy? It's a uh, JNN group. Excellent. <laughs> to me. Right. Yes. So what do you see as the best opportunities for law students who may be graduating now or just starting their careers? What advice would you give them? I think that it is self-apparent today that data guides our lives. I think that the data we accumulate on our laptop, on our cell phones, on our personal devices is almost a surrogate personality that we have. And so as a lawyer who will defend people, it's important to understand that data. It's important to uh, become appraised of how that data can be so critical to how they work. Uh, E-discovery is how that data is brought into litigation and having the necessary skill set to understand the complexities of that data uh, only put them at an advantage. Um, today, I work with very bright lawyers all the time, lawyers that have been practicing for years and years, or lawyers sometimes who have just started practicing. I think that um, I can say unanimously uh, that uh, when you see somebody who can understand the complex um, uh, uh, particularities of electronic information uh, that they are usually at an advantage, significant advantage in pleading their cases and explaining the problem or the solution uh, to a jury or to a judge. What's the most common mistake that you encounter on the, on the side of, of law firms? I don't do a discovery. I don't, I don't care about the metadata stuff. Uh, yeah. That's a question that comes very often. They uh, say that to you? They say that to me. I think more importantly uh, the, the notion is that as a data scientist or as a, a discovery expert that you know, we take things to a degree that is so much higher than most people need them to be. And I think that's, that's the make, big misconception. Um, evidence is just evidence. It's important to really look at uh, collecting that information and knowing how to handle this. There are very simple tips that most people get a, a aware of and just knowing them right now uh, will save you a lot of time and will definitely make you very successful. That's such good advice yeah. and a great place for us to stop. Yes. I'm Monica Bay at the University of Florida and thank you for watching. Thank you.